Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Alex, this is Lena, and today we're gonna cook some dinner. Ah! <laughs> Olive monster! We're gonna make a Portuguese inspired dinner. There's these things I had in Portugal called risois, and they're these amazing, they, they're kind of like shrimp empanadas, but they are so good, so we're gonna make them tonight, and we're gonna make them gluten-free. I found a recipe online. We're just gonna adjust it to make it gluten-free and dairy-free. Can I help mommy? Yeah, you can help. We try to keep, it's really organized and then it just gets overwhelming because we just buy way too much stuff. This is the gluten-free flour we've been using lately and we love it. Flour, you want to help too? Hi, Michael. Hi, guys. So this is my husband, Michael. Hi, guys. He's 100% Portuguese. What did you say, Michael? I'd like to know where the car keys are because you left the car in the middle of the driveway. You're welcome. Now you can drive my car. Why do you like to eat ice so much? Because it's water and I thirst it. You're just like really focused right now? Can you <laughs> pop it? <laughs> She's completely ignoring me. <laughs> so all we need for this recipe are these four ingredients. Milk, butter, salt, and flour. So it's two try. cups of milk. Yeah. Okay. okay, so two cups of milk. One. Wait, shake it out. Yep, two. Perfect. Now we're gonna bring it to a boil. When it boils, you add the flour, then you have to stir the flour in fast. There you go, perfect. So it was almost three cups of flour. Okay, I'll pour, you stir. You ready? Si, tengo que ir revolviendo. Yeah. I know. Go, go, go. Stir until it forms a ball. You got this, Lena. <laughs> Mi mamá se iba a sentir orgullosa. Hey, that looks good. Sí. It's not sticky. No. It's good. It's nice. The dough for the risoish here, so it didn't, doesn't get like a hard crust on it. Let's go see what Michael's making. It's a scalloped potato and I made a vegan cream with vegan sour cream, uh, vegan mozzarella, and vegan uh, cream cheese with chive. Mm, looks delicious. Bacalhau. 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 Anatas. Anatas. Okay, I found a recipe we're gonna make for dessert, and you guys are gonna help me. So this recipe is for honey cake. My daughter's about to fall off the counter. So honey cake was our favorite dessert. Every single summer we would visit my godparents in Portugal. My godparents live in Lisbon and they make the best honey cake ever. I asked her for the recipe. This recipe is from 2010. The problem is, is that she gives me the recipe and like, use one coffee spoon of cinnamon. So let's see if we can figure this out. The recipe calls for three eggs. However, I'm on an egg break. I don't know what that means. But I have to be off eggs for 30 days because it's causing inflammation, I guess, in my body. So I am doing I'm gonna sub out the three eggs for three tablespoons of this granola butter. It looks pretty cool. It's like an oat butter, but it has the same consistency as eggs, so we're gonna see if that works. Oh yeah, it's different, but it's okay. You can mix it. it looks good, yeah? What do you think? Looks good? Okay. One teaspoon of cinnamon in the bowl. What is a DL? Deckle leader? How do I measure a deciliter? Does that have that on there? Deciliter, is that a real thing? Mm -hmm. I've never heard of that. 300 grams of sugar going in the bowl. Five no, DL in no. cups. No, I, I got it, I got it. it. Two, cups. Two, Two cups. Two cups. Those cups. Those cups. Those cups. Oh my God. It's 2.1 cups to be exact. But there, this recipe, she just told me to mix everything in a bowl and it doesn't seem right. I've never done that before. We're, gonna, we're winging it, you guys. We're what? winging it. Milk. Okay. You want your mixer? Yeah. What color? Blue. There it is. This is her mixer. There you go. This is an amazing honey. Any like super dark honey is going to give you the most flavor. It's so good. I did a little bit. Harder. Go. Nice. Okay, again, one more. Cut. Nice wow, job. Okay. I'm gonna be better on this. Ooh, what? Made a mess. Easy one. No more fly. <laughs> okay. 203. Flour to the bowl and the butter. 
I've literally never made a cake like this. I always mix in like the butter and sugar first and do all that. So, <laughs> but she told me just to mix everything in a bowl. So we're gonna just go for it. Here we go. <laughs> it looks really liquidy, you know? It smells good. Here's what the batter looks like. It's pretty thin and I don't feel like it's blended too well. Next time I'm going to make it how I like know how to make a cake, but it smells really good. I'm gonna taste the batter. Oh my gosh, it tastes so good. The bunt pan. We're winging it today. Mm. It's good, right? It's good. Let's see if it comes out. Okay. What's the worst that can happen? I mean, we'll still eat it regardless if it looks ugly or not. Hi, Dad. How are you? Taking a Portuguese dinner tonight. You excited? Hi. It's Michael's dad. Bacalhau de natas. De natas. Now that Michael's dad is here, he's the expert. So he's going to help me make the shrimp. <laughs> How do you know when the shrimp is done? It's just not clear anymore? Yeah. So this is just paprika, cayenne, the onion, the butter, and garlic. the shrimp. And some garlic. Oh, you some salt. You chop it up, put these put inside the, the little the grease soy. Mm. There we go. Thinner? Yep. Three, baby. Or more. Yep. That's good. Turn it over. Drop the floor. You can leave them just like this, or you can put the little fork marks on it. Yep. However you like. Mm. And that's sticky. a little sticky. We're frying these in avocado oil, actually. Normally you put breading on them. You like dip them in egg and then breading, yeah. right? Right. But since I'm on my egg break, <laughs> I broke up with eggs for a month. Um, I eat eggs like every day. I Sometimes do too. Twice. Yummy to my tummy. Yummy to my tummy. Mm. What are you guys doing over here? Dr. Mila to the rescue? Let's see if we have any Portuguese wine. Oh, look. This one says Portugal. Look how pretty this label is. Okay, looks like that's the one we're drinking tonight. Have you had this bottle? Is yeah. it good? Oh, is this one that you brought, gave to me? Oh, okay, good. Oh. Nice that you and I started, and now we get to just drink wine and wedding. <laughs> so cute. Let's drink out of these. <laughs> Do you want a sneak peek of the cake? Ooh. It's looking good. The color looks good. Cute. And some Oh, yeah. It's too hot. Way too hot. This is called impatience. <laughs> <laughs> it was too hot to flip. Okay, but it looks good. We're still gonna eat it. <laughs> How is it? It's good? Hey. We'll try that recipe again, but we're still gonna eat it. Try this. The honey cake from Portugal? Oh, yeah, you want to try it too? Okay, come. Is it delicious? Yeah. Mommy did good? Yeah. Good, Mommy. Two thumbs up or one, two? Two. Yay. Thanks, mate. What are you playing with? Slime. Ew. Okay, it's dinner time. Wash your hands, slimy no. hands. Good job, everybody. We did it. Time to Marja. Gracias. Mm. You got your tater tots. How is it? Delicious? Yummy. They're so good. I love them. So good. Right? Uh huh. Not cool. <laughs> Time for dessert. <laughs> Look at this beauty. <laughs> Let's just go in. Eddie Fowler, Fowler. It's so good. Wow. It's so good. Thanks for hanging out with us. Bye. Bye. Make sure you subscribe if you want to stick around.
La verdad, sí. Oh, my God.